best known for his incredible roles as Jackie Robinson, King T'Challa, and James Brown. The ever-talented and beloved actor Chadwick Boseman was an amazing figure in Hollywood. With his recent passing, the world has been reminiscing about his life and realizing how much about him we just didn't know. In today's video, we'll be examining 10 surprising facts about Chadwick Boseman that you don't know. Let's get straight into the video. Number 10. He didn't audition for Black Panther. Chadwick Boseman is best known for his role as King T'Challa in the ultra-popular Marvel film Black Panther. And although this is the role that made him a worldwide icon, Boseman didn't even have to audition for the part. When the production and casting for the 2018 Black Panther began, world-renowned casting director Sarah Haley Finn made the unanimous decision to choose Boseman when she came to cast the part. Finn had been quite familiar with Boseman as he auditioned for Marvel roles in the past as well as with his body of work prior to playing the superhero. His ability to act and learn quickly was something that she stated they couldn't pass up. He was determined, prepared, thorough, and talented. Thus, the role of King T'Challa was simply given to Boseman. Once on screen, he further solidified Finn's belief in his acting and the role launched him into worldwide stardom. At number 9. He loved sports. Besides acting, Chadwick Boseman was a lover of all things sports. His favorite, however, was not baseball, but basketball. In 2013, he depicted the historic baseball player Jackie Robinson in the film 42, giving him quite the knowledge on baseball for his preparation for the film. But Boseman always had a heart for the basketball court. He spent his youth in South Carolina playing the sport, and it led him to leave his little league baseball team. He enjoyed going to basketball games as well as many players were overjoyed to see him courtside. His love for sports made his premature passing hit the sports world extremely hard, with many players from basketball to football and the NBA all paying their tributes to the actor. Number 8. Private Person In Hollywood, some celebrities like to fully take on the role of a public figure and tell us virtually everything about themselves and their lives. However, Chadwick Boseman was quite the opposite. He lived a very private life, not letting his co-workers or the media know about anything really personal. Now with his passing, we know of his battle with colon cancer, but this secret was hidden for a very long time. Virtually no one on the set of Black Panther knew of his struggle behind the scenes as he worked long days and trained very hard for all of his roles. It goes without saying, Chadwick had an incredible strength throughout his journey with cancer. And likewise, the core group that surrounded Bozeman while he battled the disease was really admirable as well. Number 7. Originally, he tried out for Drax the Destroyer. Chadwick Bozeman's work in Black Panther was truly destiny for the actor. In addition to being unanimously chosen for the role, Bozeman was rejected for a smaller role a few years prior, as if the universe knew what role he was destined to play. Bozeman originally tried out for the role of Drax the Destroyer, a character seen in the 2014 film Guardians of the Galaxy. Of course, Bozeman didn't play the role. However, going to the table read did manage to help later in getting the role of King T'Challa. The casting director, Sarah Heli Finn, then saw his potential while he read for the role and was impressed to say the least, which had her later call him for the Black Panther role. This amazing story truly depicts the saying, everything happens for a reason. At number six, humble beginnings. Before Chadwick Boseman was a famous star, he spent his early childhood in South Carolina, writing and directing wherever he could. In his small hometown of Anderson, he had a childhood filled with sports, church, youth groups, and theater. He enjoyed writing a great deal and even wrote and directed two films of his own called Heaven and produced a film, Perfect Day. Along with short films, he was also a playwright, writing a play called Deep Azure. These humble beginnings were what introduced him to his love of films especially writing and directing. Ultimately, these hobbies very quickly turned into a very successful career. Number 5. He's the first to win a SAG award as a Marvel lead. Although Marvel films are insanely popular with them breaking box office records, making billions of dollars, and creating probably one of the biggest fan bases of all times, they're tragically underrepresented in the award arena. Film critics don't always appreciate the Marvel Universe and many of its films. However, the late Chadwick Boseman changed that for Marvel. His outstanding performance won the studio three Academy Awards, the first ever for Marvel. 
For Bozeman himself, his role as T'Challa gave him more than just immense admiration, but also a Screen Actors Award, or SAG Award. This was the very first time a Marvel lead received the award, making his work in Black Panther truly record-breaking. As quite the talented actor, Bozeman's success along with the success of the film was really well-deserved as the casting was superb, the costumes were incredible, and in general, the movie felt outstandingly well done. Marvel will forever be grateful for his amazing work. Number 4. Denzel Washington Paid His Tuition It's a pretty well-known fact that college can be expensive, as every year students are looking for aid, scholarships, and just about any way they can help pay the tuition. However, not many people are as lucky as Chadwick Boseman. He had a special group of Hollywood friends help him out while he was just starting out in the industry. As the story goes, Felicia Rashad had mentored Boseman at the time and wanted him to partake in a summer program at the world-renowned English University, Oxford. However, Chadwick, although he wanted to participate, didn't have the funds to do the program. Rashad stepped up to help Boseman out by calling up some Hollywood friends and asking if they could help lend a hand. One of the biggest supporters of this was action movie megastar Denzel Washington, who helped pay a big chunk of the tuition. Washington was really impressed at Chadwick's ability as an actor and truly wanted to see him succeed in the industry. His money was well donated as Chadwick went on to be a very talented and successful actor. Number 3. Felicia Rashad was his mentor Speaking of those in Hollywood that helped foster Chadwick Boseman's career, one of the biggest celebrities behind him was none other than Felicia Rashad. Rashad, best known for her long and prosperous acting career on shows like The Cosby Show and works like A Raisin in the Sun, was the perfect person to mentor the young Chadwick Boseman. Both Howard University alumni, Rashad helped Chadwick discover his love for acting and really hone in on his craft. Her witty nature and ever-talented, kind soul truly transmitted onto Chadwick as he carried himself in Hollywood with such poise and grace, just like her. Their work together transcended far more than apprentice and mentor relationships, but that of close friends. She's helped him achieve his goals in acting and gave him much advice in navigating the industry, especially as a person of color. Coming in at number two, his first role was on a soap opera and he got fired. Chadwick Boseman, before training with the great Felicia Rashad, started to gain some traction and picked up one of his first roles in All My Children. His character was set to be the young character Reggie Porter, who in the show was a troubled youth who was involved in gangs and crime. Boseman wasn't happy with this role and the stereotypes it portrayed of young black men, so he spoke out about it to the production. Although the role was altered a bit after Bozeman spoke out about it, Chadwick didn't get to play the role as he was fired for his actions, stating that he was just too much trouble to deal with. While this was a very unfortunate thing to happen to Bozeman, there's a hint of foreshadowing in place as his successor for the role of Reggie Porter was none other than his future Black Panther co-star, Michael B. Jordan. And at number one, he actually didn't want to be an actor at all. Chadwick is pretty much known for his work as an actor, but he actually never envisioned himself to be anything close to a movie star. Bozeman originally went to school for writing and directing at Howard University. He was a behind-the-scenes kind of guy and wanted to focus on writing scripts and directing, not to be in front of the camera. It wasn't until he met his mentor, Rashad, that made him make the switch. When she saw his raw potential, she couldn't help but wonder why he wasn't intending on pursuing acting. Bozeman's fateful decision to follow her advice completely changed his world, leading him to an abundance of success and opening the door once again for the black community in playing roles that were generally not considered for them. As the first black Marvel superhero, Chadwick Bozeman's legacy will live on for decades in the hearts of many as his life speaks of strength, representation, and how fate and destiny can change your life. As we remember the late, great Chadwick Boseman, we hope you've enjoyed this video. Tell us your favorite memory of the amazing actor in the comments below. Be sure to like this video and subscribe to Celeb Space for more content on your favorite celebrities in Hollywood. We'll see you in the next video. Bye.